This is why you're not allowed to hunt with drones. Yeah, it's really not fair, is it? Mm -mm. Those were before. We're driving through the mountains today up to Big Sky. This mountain pass must just get a lot of snow. We see the snow poles on the sides of the road. <laughs> Big launch for Big Sky. <laughs> Welcome to Big Sky, Montana. We are here amongst the housing community way up on the hillside, and they're all skiable places. There's trails that go down and ski lifts you can get up on the mountain, and some even take you back up to your house here. This is Definitely gonna add it to our bucket list for a, a winter trip, I think. Looks like you can go all the way to the top. The Big Sky Visitor Center let us drop our rig in their parking lot while we went up and checked out the mountain. So now we're all hitched back up and on our way to Bozeman. We're here in Bozeman, Montana now, and we're gonna bike into town. We're just staying at Walmart for the night. Bike into town and see what downtown looks like. <laughs> the Bozeman Distillery to try their Huckleberry Vodka and their whiskey. What do you think of the Huckleberry Vodka? Yeah, I like Michigan Cherry Vodka better. Yeah, well. <laughs> It was done in metal with the uh, with some sort of a device to etch the metal. Amazing. The bubbles go. Oh come on. You do better than that. There you go. Well, we've had a lot of fun in Bozeman. They've served us a lot of wine and Caitlin got a new hat. How do you like it? And uh, <laughs> We've been having a good time here. Wow, that's a good puppy. Hello everybody, we are in Butte, Montana today visiting a family friend. And we're biking around the town today because we've only got one day here, seeing what we can see. And this town has one of these giant M's up on the hill up here. It represents that it's a, a university town. Behind me over here is a uh, Montana Tech University. University towns have these giant M's on the hill. This one lights up at night, which is cool. On the other hill, over here, um, there is a giant statue of uh, the Virgin Mary, 90 feet tall, up on top of the hill there. And that is Our Lady of the Rockies. <laughs> So everywhere you look around this town you see the head frames, remnants of the mining days and there is still a lot of mining in this town. Although it's not a company town but the mining was done right downtown and there's head frames just throughout the town. The head frames are where they lowered the, uh, the men and the, the buckets to dig the rock out of the earth straight down into the, into the earth. They mine copper mostly but also uh, molybdenum, something like that. Museum, zinc, silver, gold. All, a whole bunch of metals, but mainly copper out here. In the 50s, they went from this straight down mining to open pit mining, and there's a couple massive pits around here, including the Berkeley pit. So here's a mine. It's a mile high from sea level, but it's a mile deep down to the bottom of where they dug. Oh, 
So we're standing here at the Granite Mountain Memorial, which is a memorial to the men who lost their lives in the Granite Mountain Mine fire. Um, it was the most deadly mine accident in the world and 168 men lost their lives in a fire and this commemorates uh, <clears throat> commemorates the location and um, the accident. So behind me here is the Berkeley Pit, an open pit mine and this is probably kind of sadly what Butte is really known for. Uh, this is the largest Superfund site in the U.S. It is a incredibly toxic heavy metal sludge that has filled in this old mining pit. They quit mining in I think 83 and they turned off the pumps and water back filled into the pit and it's, as, it's incredibly toxic and they have to try and treat it and prevent it from rising up to the groundwater level where it would actually get back into the water table. So. This is uh, a little bit what's left from the, the mining days. Well, here's a pretty great overlook of the city. We've been biking around this trail system they call the Top of the World Trail System. It takes you through the old mining areas of, uh, of Butte up on the hillside. They have really great information plaques, and it's really, other than steep, a pretty nice ride. <laughs> Goodbye, Butte. It was interesting learning about your mining history and uh, touring on our bikes. We had a good time. Welcome to Missoula, Montana. We are here at the Big Sky Brewing Company and we're going to go taste some of their beer. Puppies have to wait outside. <laughs> wandered into a place that gives you free beer. You can have four of these per person, per day, for free here. Taste their beer. And their names are great. I'm drinking Moose Drool, which happens to be the number one selling Montana brewed beer. Yep, Montanians and their mooses. 